Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue while launching the game Battlefield 6 onto the Steam. The game is crashing just after the splash screen without any kind of error code. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. First of all in the basic step, go ahead and download the Nvidia app if you haven't do so. After downloading, install it and then launch it. Once the app is launched, you need to open the global settings and you need to do two changes one by one. First one is smooth motion. If you have turned it on, turn off the smooth motion. And second one is low latency mode. Turn it off. After doing these two changes, launch the Steam, right click on the game and go to its properties. From the left pane, click on the option DLC. Now under DLC, you will find various DLCs. But from here, you need to uncheck Battlefield Multiplayer SD Marker and Battlefield Multiplayer Marker. Uncheck these two DLCs and then try to launch the game to fix out the issue. If this failed to work out, in next step, you need to update your GPU drivers. Especially in case of AMD users, these 25.10.1 drivers are not available on their official site when you search for them. You need to Google these drivers, only then you will find these drivers right from the official website. Go ahead, scroll down and click on the link to download these drivers into your PC. Download them and install into your system to fix out the issue. In case of NVIDIA, type in the details of your GPU right over here and click on the option start search to find the relevant drivers. Once the search is completed, you need to download WHQL recommended drivers by clicking on the option get download. You can see the battlefield is supported right in these drivers only. Download them and relaunch the game to fix out the issue. If this method also failed to work out, in next step, you need to enter into the BIOS menu and find a setting with the name XMP profile or EXPO. If you have turned it on, make sure you turn it off. This will disable the overclocking of your CPU or GPU. After doing so, you need to update the BIOS, which is a mandatory step. So make sure to update your BIOS right from your motherboard manufacturer website. And after doing these two steps, relaunch the game to fix out the issue. If none of these methods help you resolve the issue, you need to open up your Windows security. Click on the option App and Browser Control. Scroll down and click on Exploit Protection Settings. Now here click on Program Settings and click on this plus icon and choose the option Choose Exact Path. Now you need to provide the exact path of the Battlefield 6. Open the directory of the game and here is Battlefield6.exe file. Click on the option Open to add right over here. Now you need to change few settings right over here. So scroll down and you will find CFG. Choose the option Override and turn it off. Nextly is DEP. Again Override and turn it off. Nextly is Force Randomization of Images. Again make sure you turn it off. Next is Randomize Memory Allocation. Turn it off by clicking on Override System Settings. Next is Validate Exception Chain. Again check mark and turn it off. And lastly is Heap Integrity. Check mark and turn it off. After doing these changes, click on the option apply. Now go ahead and restart your computer and relaunch your game and this will completely fix out the issue of Battlefield 6 crashing after the splash screen. So that's all about it friends. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue saving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.